At the Connor High School track, no one was ever faster at 100 and 200 meters than LaMail Borders, school record holder, regional champ. The family says the last words he ever spoke were slow down. He's going to be greatly missed around here. A lot of the kids looked up to him and played with him. Roberta Powell is pastor of the First Baptist Church of Burlington and very close to LaMail's family. They appreciate everybody that's calling and, and stopping by and, and giving their condolences and their, offering their sympathy. And um, the mother, she's handling as best as she can being a mother that just lost a son. LaMail graduated from Connor last year. He hoped to be a veterinarian one day, but his future was ended with this crash. 3.18 a.m., he was a passenger when the car left the road, slammed into a tree, went through a fence, and launched into a neighboring yard. Family says survivors in the car told them Lamal had just told the driver to slow down. He's now being remembered for how he treated others. Very um, respectful. Um, it was always yes ma'am, no ma'am. The driver of the vehicle is Anthony Yeager, 22. He's facing a long list of charges, including manslaughter, DUI, and possession of drug paraphernalia. Two 15-year-old passengers also sustained injuries, not thought to be life-threatening. But LaMail's family goes from planning his future to preparing for his funeral. Just asked everybody to pray for him. Here we go. Now here's a relationship of the people that were in that vehicle. Now LaMail was very good friends with the driver's brother. Now, LaMail with the two 15-year-olds, because one of them had just become an uncle, they were in the neighborhood, they went to visit the, the baby, they had just come back, and Jaeger, the driver, pulls up and says, hop in. Now, no one knows where they were going, but that's how they all got in that car together. Reporting live, Brian Hemrick, WLWT News 5. <laughs>